Um, first, I'd like to talk about my testimony, too. Uh, most people know here I, I was an alcoholic, and I was battling with a lot of things. And yeah. I just, at that point in my life, I really didn't care what God thought of me. But he's always been there for me. And after I, after I got saved and got into Word a little bit, I started realizing the Holy Spirit pointed out to me what he had done for me, where I was in car wrecks and people died all around me. And I come out with scratches and cuts. That made me realize I had a plan. He had a plan for me. I wasn't a monster. I wasn't. I didn't drink because I was sad. I drank. I drank to have fun, and I, it seemed like it intensified my fun. And uh, I know that a lot of people wouldn't agree with this, but I was a functioning alcoholic, and I have seen those because I thought, oh, I ain't got a problem. I, I'm not. I don't miss my kids' appointments. I don't miss work. I don't do this. I didn't see the problem. And then when I got saved, that's when I. It was probably two weeks into it, and uh, I started shaking, and I, I knew that I was an alcoholic. And I hit my knees in my bathroom, and I said, God, if you take this from me. I, just, I needed confirmation because I had a feeling, you know, that little feeling you get when you first get saved, but oh, yeah. I needed to see something. Yeah. And I felt it, and I, in one day, I didn't have sickness, nothing. I knew I was in having what they call detox, DTs, sure. because I was shaky, yeah. I was throwing up, I knew what it was, it wasn't a virus. Yeah. I knew it had been a week since I drank. Yeah. And I never even thought to drink in that week. <laughs> That's what, you know, how good the Holy Spirit is, he, he took it. And I don't, I've testified before, Rachel and I were at a local bar and we were invited to a fish fry and I had a beer and I went back three times to get three beers. That's how hard headed I was because he took the taste out of my mouth. And. Um, Right then, I knew I slid that beer back, and I said, "I'll never drink another beer." What was wrong with it? It was. It tasted uh, like really bitter and skunked, so like it was bad. Beer. Yeah, I went back three times to get three different beers, it was the wrong beer. and it, but it was God took the taste out of my mouth. My testimony to me is how God touched my life. He showed me my errors. He showed me how to, He didn't tell me you had to do it. He gave me a choice every time to make every decision I made in my Christian life. He said, "Hey." Here's an opportunity for you to take over youth. Well, God, I'm scared. I don't want to, you know, mislead these kids. I knew he had my back. So my testimony is my church, too. After a couple years here, I felt a personal res res responsibility to not sit in the pews anymore, to, to volunteer for Usher, to volunteer here. Hey, you need help with this. Hey, you need help with that. That showed me my, my first gift, I heart of a servant. It don't matter if I'm, if I'm leading youth, helping pastors, setting up mics, doing the live feed, or cleaning the toilet to me. It's our church. We start in these walls, and that's how we get out outside of these walls. <laughs>